The Lagos State Government says about 5,000 motorcycles have been crushed in the first quarter of the year 2022. Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Minga Motoshow, made it known at the crashing site in Alausa. He said the 2,000 bikes which were crushed today show how serious the government is in its enforcement. Plus TV correspondent Lavi Kukwe Edokon tells us more. motorcycles, also known as Okadas, being crushed by the Lagos state government. It goes to show the seriousness that the state government attaches to ensuring that the state is rid of Okadas and his menace. Commissioner for Information, Benga Omotosho, and Transport Commissioner, Dr. Frederick Oladende, walked journalists through the crushing site to witness the destruction of the motorbikes. People have been wondering what... We've been doing with the Okadas that have been taken out of a town. So for you to see what we have been doing with them, this is why we invited you here today. I'm happy you have seen the way they have been crushed. Mr. Omotosho says that the government had to take the enforcement seriously due to the excesses of the riders and the alarming rate of road accidents recorded this year alone. In the first four months of this year, we had 1,712 Okada accidents. Of these, seven hundred uh, of road accidents, of the 1,712, 767 were due to Okada. A motor show, however, called on riders securing to the state or promoting transport schemes to get actively engaged. Commissioner for Transportation, Frederick Oladende, urged residents to remain calm and obey traffic laws as alternative means of transportation have been provided. We're putting more high capacity buses uh, on the road. Um, the government is working around the clock to make sure that our rail system is, uh, is working. We've increased the number of boats on our waterways and they should just be calm and then uh, move about their daily uh, business. Chairman of Lagos State Tax Force says there is no going back on the enforcement we don't see Okadas on the road, on the express, any longer. The number has drastically reduced. But I know for sure, and I'm passing this information to them because they, they are watching us. They might be of the belief that the first one week of the enforcement will be thorough. After one week, we are going to relax. Anyway, we will, we will watch and see. But I'm passing this uh, message to them that from next week, we will do more intense enforcement with the recent pronouncement and the continued enforcement on the ban legations hope he's not short-lived so that the sanity is sustained from lagos La hello hope you enjoyed the news please do subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates